So you are it at Triangle Coffee in Somerville, Massachusetts. We operate out of Brooklyn Boulders, which is a big climbing gym, state-of-the-art climbing gym, kind of multi-use space. Um, there's like a co-working space upstairs, so it's like a real community area. It's, like a, it's a different scenario because people who cross the threshold to come here aren't necessarily coming for coffee. They, a lot of people don't know we're here. A lot of people do. They find us from Yelp and um, just from word of mouth. But it's, it's cool because we interact with people who aren't super familiar with, we serve blue bottle coffee, they're not familiar with blue bottle or Chemexes are really new to them, specialty coffee in general, so we get to tap into that platform and just have fun with it. We're super laid back. We just want to share good coffee with people and like not judge people. Um, but then there's also the people who are super dialed in and they love coming here and give us a lot of support. Like I was mentioning before, we're really psyched to open up a second spot in the seaport and kind of start all over again because I think Boston's going to be way different from Somerville. Somerville is really, you know, laid back. A lot of young people, a lot of students, young families, young professionals. Um, and it's kind of like a more of a more of like a scrappy community of people who are artists and people who are supporting creativity and I guess projects kind of like this can be successful here. Not that Boston wouldn't allow success for that, but I think things are just like kind of on a different scale. So it'll be, it'll be cool. It'll definitely be different. We love single origin coffees. Um, so we try to have a, a drip blend, which is what this is. It's uh, Blue Bottles Three Africans and then a single origin. So we, we always have this three Africans and then we rotate the single origin. Um, so this is, it also is just like a delicious coffee and really shines on Chemex. But this we're dosing 26. So it might be a little, it's definitely like a, a robust, like light to medium roast. Um, people feel like a blend is not gonna be as exciting. But this one's like, it's nice. We selected it for one reason, to kind of introduce people who aren't used to, like maybe want to put a lot of cream and sugar in their coffee, which is fine if that's how you want to drink it, but you can enjoy this black, and it gives you like an intro to complex complexity, but it's still super approachable. Um, so it's kind of like baby steps towards maybe like a slightly crazier coffee. You know, you kind of have to guide your customers and give them the right expectation towards like it's going to take a little bit longer but it's going to be delicious and it worked really well so we didn't feel like we had to move away from it um, but basically I mean it just for us it's like we didn't have to build a drip bar we can just like have this perfectly contained pour over and carafe and they're beautiful and it makes like actually also Blue Bottle sources a lot of their coffee because pour over is some of their is like their best brew method. A lot of their coffees, especially single origins, shine in Chemex, so it just went really well.